Hey guys, what's going on, Matt here, and welcome back to the Blackout Stream Mod Tools tutorial series. So then, in this video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to pretty much change your last stand weapon. So, whether you want it to be changed in solo or in co-op, uh, you can have two different weapons, or you can have the same one. It's completely up to you how you want it. But when you go down, um, this is going to be the weapon, which obviously, you know, you basically have use of. So what we're going to do first of all is go over to our root directory. We go over to user maps, go to your map name. So in this case, I'm using ZM test day. Go over to scripts, ZM, and the map name .gsc version. Okay, make sure it's the .gsc. So we'll open up that, and you'll be greeted with this. Um, of course, this is a pretty much a very, very, very fresh map that I've got here. So there's pretty much nothing in here. Um, all you're going to do is you'll go into the, into the description of this video and you'll find some lines of code. I'm just going to copy it from my other screen. And under the user map main part here, just go enter underneath there and you see we have four lines. So this is a comment. This is pretty much ignored by the actual game. It's just literally a comment just so we know what's what. And um, then you have the last stand weapon. So this is the actual weapon name. Um, in this case, I'm using Raygun. And um, that's, of course, the Raygun. Um, if you want to use any other weapon, feel free to change this name to the... Um, the name of the actual weapon um, the actual name itself is within your weapons um, CSV so you can use that um, I'm pretty sure I go over that in in, in another video though um, you know customizing so you know what's in the box and stuff but you'll find all the weapon names in there so all we can all we need to do is pretty much change these lines here okay if you want different weapons now as it is that's perfectly fine that's going to give you the ray gun um, or you know or whatever gun you put here um, as your last stand weapon both on solo and on co-op now if you want to use different weapons all we need to do is instead of having this is a variable okay so this gun name is being stored within here and then it's being used on both of these okay if we, if we were to use it on individual ones all we would do is copy this and put it into these individually and then change these individually okay so this part here is of course the co-op part and where it has solo this is of course the solo um sort of you know variant of that so all you need to do is literally change what's ever inside these double you know inside these uh, speech marks and that is what weapon you'll be you know that is what weapon you'll be given uh, in this case so i want it to be the same for both so i'm using this up here but you know customize it however you want easy as that guys um, all i'm going to do is i'm going to just save this now go and do a quick uh, link in the launcher so i can show you guys in game it actually working so i'll see you guys over at black ops 3 okay so over at black ops 3 now then, let's just actually i should probably go and get some quick revives so it actually revives me so of course this is the solo version let's hold a grenade down ourselves let's see we now have the ray gun as soon as we go down easy as that uh, of course you know change that weapon name to whatever you want if you do want to use a certain weapon and you're not too sure of the name please leave a comment um i do tend to reply quite fast to comments in general um providing i actually get enough notification for it that is <laughs> uh, but yeah if you do need to know what uh, what weapon name anything is just leave a comment i'll try and help you guys out there if you are having difficulties um so yeah hopefully this has helped and of course thanks for the support and i'll catch you guys later bye for now